Hello and a good day, good afternoon, good morning. Welcome. I'm Dr. Lakeisha McKnight. This is the Leadership TKO Live Show. Welcome aboard, ladies and gents from all over the world. Those of you who are tuning in by way of podcast, hello to you. Those of you on Facebook tuning into the live stream, welcome. And even for those of you who may be checking this out by way of the Leadership TKO Show, on a YouTube, the channel there, I do welcome you here to today's show. Yes, it's a beautiful Monday, November the 6th of 2023, when I'm actually doing this live. All right. And so just know that with the Leadership TKO Live Night Show, this is a stream. This is a, a video for those of you on YouTube that I provide every Monday and Wednesday. Now, the live streams are 6.30 p.m. Eastern time, and then we upload it from that point forward onto YouTube. And for those of you on the podcast, you're tuning in live as well as I'm doing this. So again, welcome everyone to the show. What I want to do first and foremost is just make sure that a couple of things are indeed in order. All right. I want to make sure that a wide range of people throughout the world including yourself, can tune in and hear this. Now, as you're coming in, don't forget everyone to let me know in the comment section, your city and your state, where you are actually tuning in from. I want to hear from you. I want to make sure that I understand and can connect with you. All right, so go ahead and drop that in the comment section, okay? Put it in the comment section. Good evening. I do see Emily Wondalo. She's tuning in from the UK, everybody. Welcome uh, to the stream, Emily. We do see you there on Facebook. And for everybody that's going to come on in, welcome. Now, I will tell you, if you're new to the stream or to this channel, uh, the purpose of Leadership TKO is to empower men and women, network marketers, wealth builders with the ability to win from the inside out, growing your influence your impact, and your income. So if you're tuning in right now and you're someone, you're saying with Dr. Lakeisha, you know, how do I maneuver and make the transition from J-O-B or the corporate space into network marketing? Maybe you're trying to figure out how to become a stronger leader in the network marketing space or to rise up as a leader in the space. Perhaps you want to build your wealth and you want to increase your income. You want passive income. Well, continue to tune in right here, either on Facebook, YouTube, or even the podcast platforms, because I'm going to share with you how to get it done. Now, if you're new and you're like, well, Dr. Lakeisha, tell me a little bit about yourself. What makes you a source for this information? Well, a little bit about my background. I am married to an Army vet of over 17 years, right? Mr. McKnight, and we have two beautiful children. Now, before my husband and I expanded our family, you know, we, we were working. We were doing what we needed to do uh, to put food on the table, just like many families, just perhaps like yourself. And, you know, I got involved with the John Maxwell team as a certified speaker, trainer, and coach. I was also doing some life coaching in the community, and I enjoyed every moment of it, but it was pulling me away from my family. All right. I didn't have time freedom. I had to exchange hours for dollars still, no matter what I did, even if I traveled to beautiful places around the world, and I conducted leadership training for them, I was still having to be on a platform, right? Exchanging time of my life to receive some sort, sort of payment or money through a contract. And so that is not freedom because if I wasn't physically there, I would not get paid. And so my husband and I, we knew that we needed a better way by which we can create income, which we can really be the leaders we wanted to be for our children. And so, yes, we eventually had children and it, it just made matters worse. And so we wanted to make sure we were physically there, not just, you know, mentally and, you know, not just physically and having our minds somewhere else, but we needed a better way to create more income and be able to take care of our family. And so we connected with some amazing leaders, wealth builders, wealth builders worldwide, it's now Wealth Builders Global, right? And so we connected to this leadership team, these people who live all over the world, and we're, we began on this journey of building wealth. And so ever since then, guess what's happened? I've become a full-time homeschooling mom, that's right, teaching my children from home, building wealth, 
creating income. I have streams coming out from different places. I don't know. Like sometimes I even look to lose track of the streams of income that we have coming into the home. And so we're extremely blessed. And so I'm ready to get started. Enough about me. I'm ready to get started to share with you this content tonight because I have a topic matter at hand that I want to share with you. Are you ready to get the content tonight? Because on Mondays, I declared Mondays to be Network Marketing Monday. Okay, it is Network Marketing Monday. And if you are a network marketer, even if you're just getting into the space, type in Network Marketing in the chat. Put it in the comment section. That lets me know that you're following along. Type in Network Marketing. It doesn't matter if you're in affiliate marketing, internet marketing, put in Network Marketing in the chat. I want to hear from you. So I have some visuals. I know some of you like visuals. And so I'm going to pull up some visuals right in front of us because I want to make sure that all of this great content tonight really sinks in, like you really get it. And so here we go. I'm about to share my screen. Boom, just like that. Here we go. We're talking about the ABCs of network marketing, mastering the fundamentals for success. Now, if you're ready for this information, you're wanting to master the fundamentals. Now, some of this information is going to be really based on the legendary Eric Warre, who wrote and published a book entitled Network Marketing Pro. How many of you have that book? Type me in the comment section. If you have that book, if you've read it once, maybe twice, <laughs> I've read it quite a few times, and it's still important to really go over it and master certain skills in terms of network marketing. So I'm going to go over this with you. Uh, and again, this information can really bless those of you who are in affiliate marketing and you know entrepreneurs overall. Some of these concepts still apply. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive in. We got to do it because by the end of today's stream, here's what I tell you. You're going to be able to gain a solid understanding of the fundamental principles of network marketing. You're going to be able to unlock the power of a positive mindset. Learn how to set clear and, and achievable goals, ladies and gentlemen. You're going to be able to identify your target audience and create a compelling vision of your network marketing success. So these are really the building blocks of your journey towards financial freedom and personal growth in the network marketing industry. And so we got to start here with what you see on the screen. Okay. What is network marketing? And feel free in the comment section to let me know what your thoughts are. What do you think about what network marketing is? Type it in the comment section. I love a bit of interaction. So go ahead and let me know for those of you tuning in, Nina Clark, Melvin Arnum, you know, Emily Wondalo. And I know many of you are probably tuning in again from different places. What are your thoughts about network marketing? We got to stick with the basics. It's really, when it comes to really defining it, this is how I think about it. And I have my handy notes here, just in case you're wondering, what is she looking at? I have my notes. I want to make sure I stay focused here. So it really is a business model, everyone. It's a business model that empowers individuals just like you to distribute products and build teams to generate income. I'm going to say this one more time. Network marketing is a business model that empowers individuals just like yourself to distribute products. You're not creating them but it empowers you to be able to distribute, to be able to promote them and get it out there into the world. Building teams as well to generate income. It's all about leveraging your network. Type in the word leverage in the comment section. That word is very important when it comes to network marketing. Type in the word leverage and building a business of your own, okay? You can build a business of your own. And so this is what I think of when I think about network marketing. So one of the fundamentals we need to consider in this industry is you need to work on your mindset, okay? It's the power of mindset that we really need to focus in on. Someone type that in. Type in the word mindset. 
because this is a crucial element here. Your attitude and your belief in yourself play a massive role when it comes to network marketing. You know, a positive entrepreneurial mindset can be a game changer when it comes to this industry. Your thoughts about your actions, what you do on a daily basis, you know, can really, you got to really keep it positive. Someone put it in the comment section, keep it positive. Read books to keep yourself positive. Listen to motivational content to keep yourself positive, especially throughout the day. Because there are going to be some people who they have their own thoughts about network marketing. They didn't really give it a try. You're going to talk to them and there are going to be people who say no. There are going to be people who ghost you. There are going to be people who are just downright not polite. Okay? There may be some people who may cuss you out. But you still need to keep it positive, okay? You still need to keep it positive. So a positive mindset is gonna be critical. And not only that, you have to be able to set your network marketing goals. And I think a lot of these points are important, especially as we're here in this fourth quarter of 2023. You wanna set your network marketing goals, okay? Goal setting is another important element here. Define what you want to achieve in your network marketing journey. Is it five thousand? Is it is it twenty thousand a month? Is it fifty thousand a month? Right? Is it you know going on vacation once a month or once every two months with your family? What does your goals consist of? You see, a goal without a plan is just a wish. So you want to make sure you're very concrete. You, you have a target date that you want to achieve your goal by. You want to make sure it's realistic, okay? And give yourself some room. Give yourself time to grow when it comes to these goals as well. Now, beyond just setting your goals in network marketing, whether it's short-term goals or long-term goals, remember short-term are those goals that you can achieve within, I'll say, within six months. And then long-term, you're pushing it towards a year to maybe three years or even five years. These are long-term goals in my, in my mindset, okay? So you want to have both types of goals when it comes to building your business, all right? And so that's, that's goal setting. But even beyond that, you really want to understand your target market as well, okay? Who are you speaking to? Who are you, uh, you know, prospecting or sharing your opportunity with? Who, because everyone is not going to get in. Everyone is not going to say yes uh, to your opportunity, so knowing your target market is vital. You know, who are you trying to reach with your products or your business opportunity? You want to conduct a, just a teeny bit of research, just a teeny bit, okay? Understand what their needs are. What do they need? What do mothers need? If you're, if you're trying to target mothers, if you're trying to reach mothers with your product, what do mothers need? If you're trying to target those individuals who are struggling with their weight, what do they need? How about individuals who are struggling financially? They have more month at the end of their money. You know that they need more passive income. They need more supplemental income or to totally replace their income. So tailor your approach accordingly when it comes to reaching your target market. And where are they? Are they on Facebook? Facebook targets a more older crowd. I want to say between 35 to maybe 50. It's an older, mature crowd. If you're targeting a younger crowd, you might want to think about places like Instagram or TikTok. Those are where the younger people are hanging out. <laughs> so these are just some things to consider. A more corporate crowd, you're going to look at LinkedIn as a platform. Now, even beyond your target market, you want to definitely create a compelling, a compelling vision. Create a compelling vision, ladies and gents, okay? That's gonna be your driving force right there. Envision what success looks like for you in network marketing. It's your why, it's what drives you, what caused you to say, you know what, let me look into this opportunity or let me consider a home-based business in the network marketing industry. What is it for you? What is it that's saying, you know, enough is enough. I need to do something. I want to try network marketing. Not even try. I'm going to I'm going to give it a go. I'm going to go at it for 90 days. I'm going to just go for the go. Right? 
Your vision will motivate you and keep you going. What do you envision for you and your family? Do you see yourself traveling the different, you know, islands around the world? I have some leaders who've gone island hopping, you know, doing a wealth summit. Do you want to go island hopping? Do you want to create, you want to build a home from scratch, from the ground up? What is a part of your vision? What is on your vision board, right? We're about to head into a brand new year. How have you, how much have you accomplished from your vision board? Do you need to take some things off? Did you reach any of those goals from your vision board? But you want to create one and then, of course, review it throughout the year and update it along the way. But creating a compelling vision is very, very important. And so we talked about quite a bit, everybody. We talked about the mindset. We talked about setting network marketing goals. We also talked about the importance of having a vision because if you don't have a vision, where are you going? And if you're following someone who doesn't have a vision, it's like the blind leading the blind. No one is going to get anywhere. If anything, you all are going to probably go in the wrong direction, both of you. And no one is going to be happy. So you want to have a vision. Where do you want to go with this business, with the opportunity? Okay. Where do you see yourself by the end of this year? What goals would you have completed or accomplished? For those of you who are building wealth, how many assets are you going to accumulate? For those of you in GSP with me, how many certificates are you going to acquire? Certificates that's going to put your money to work for you. Think about this for yourself. How many new people do you want to bring on board that will what that will build the business with you? Okay, what is your goal for that by by December 31st? So these are just some things to consider when it comes to your business. So where are we going? What's happening next? What are we going to cover? Well, first, here's what I will say. I do want to thank you for just taking this short period of time to be with me today. We've covered some of the basics of network marketing. The power of mindset, goal setting, and identifying your target market. Who are you reaching? Who is your ideal prospect? You know, creating a compelling vision. And now what I want to tell you is that coming up next, we're going to dive deeper into building a strong team within network marketing. We're going to talk about mastering duplication, which is critical when it comes to perhaps ranking up in your company that you're a part of. All right. So ranking up is it's a big deal. Build a team. And we're going to talk about how to really scale your network marketing business to newer heights. How do you take it global? How what are some things, some things you can do from the comfort of your home with your cell phone that will scale your business? So don't miss out. Stay tuned. Stay engaged. And together we're going to make a powerful impact on this industry. So here is what I'm encouraging you to do as we're wrapping this thing up. For those of you on Facebook, if you've enjoyed what you've heard today, give it a thumbs up, give it a heart, show the stream some love. The same for those of you on the podcast platforms. And if you're on YouTube, listen, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that you're aware of when fresh content is uploaded right here on the channel. So with that being said, look, don't miss it. We're going to have some more fresh content about network network marketing next Monday, Lord willing, 6.30 p.m. Eastern time. So listen, until the next time, for those of you tuning in, if you want more network marketing help, subscribe to the channel on YouTube. If you want more one-on-one -on -one consulting and coaching, you're going to have to reach out to me. For those of you on Facebook, reach out to me via inbox because I'll be more than happy to help. I do help people in the form of coaching. Okay. So with that being said, thank you so much. Be blessed. And remember to think, to speak, and to live leadership. Good night. Good morning. Good afternoon to you. And God bless.